While you can do your own unit testing from the ground up, it's smart to use a unit testing framework if one is available in your development environment. CUnit is a classic example framework, although it doesn't really matter which one you use as long as it suits your purposes. In CUnit, there's a test registry which contains a number of test suites, and a test suite is a set of related test cases. A test case is a procedure that runs one or more executions of a module for the purpose of testing. Typically, it's better if a test case has either one case or a number of variations on a very narrow theme to keep things consistent within the test case. An assertion is a statement that determines if a test has passed or failed. Remember that just exercising the software isn't good enough. You have to also know that the test passed by comparing the output values to see if they're what's expected. As an example of a test case, let's consider you have a function that takes two integers and returns the maximum. You would define test maxi with the test underscore part being there to help the framework know that these two routines correspond to each other. Test maxi is a test case and it has three different assertions in it. CU, standing for C unit assert, is true if the logical relation is true and false if it's not. The test passes if it's true. The test fails if it's false. And here we say the max of 0 and 2 should be 2. The max of 0 and negative 2 should be 0. And the max of 2 and 2 should be 2. In practice, a C unit test looks like long lists of CU asserts or other similar assertions and inside the assertion is a test that sends inputs to the unit you're trying to test and then checks for the expected output. 